Welcome back to Let's Play Carrion. I'm Burning Dogface, and last time, the flesh wandered out into the human city. We don't know what happened next. But, uh, other than the ending, I've been exploring looking for the canisters, and I found one, I just couldn't figure out for the life of me how to get to it. Oh. Yeah, I've noticed this guy. I don't know what his, what his deal is. You know, I'm gonna save. Oh, I don't want to retrieve biomass, though, because here's the thing. I might not be able to armor myself, but I can turn it off. Well, there's the Armored Warfare facility, and this is a completely dead end otherwise. Shit. I rocked face there. Uh... Thank you, me. Okay. Sure. Down. Down. I don't like that even the tunnels between areas are lined with teeth. Excuse me, do you happen to know? Never mind, you're probably dying of radiation sickness at this point. Weird that it's nighttime here, huh? But nowhere else. Ah! Oh, that was fucking dumb as shit. Ah. Don't touch the spinny bits, just in case. Have you seen any Relith logos around? I mean, come on, man. Throw me a frickin' bone here, or I'll start taking some of yours. Oh, so, yeah, that's the direction I came from, because it's the one I just came out of. Still radiation in here. Still radiation. Still radioactive in here, is what I meant to say. Aren't those supposed to be, like completely submerged in water or something. Do you and the piece of the mech want to be alone, sir? Oh, shit. I don't even remember this area. Apparently I've been here, though. Ah! Man. Well, it probably means is I'm as far as I can get from one of those things. Hmm. I might have to just bite the bullet. Huh, that's weird. I never opened that. And, uh, check a walkthrough for these burning dog fans. Oh! Oh, I should have steeped that body there. Chickala. Congratulations! You're finally useful to me. Ah, oh, shit! I guess that's what uh, Rachel Starn is about, like, moving along like this, just sliding along like a train. In those tunnels, like this one down here, I think. Where you just see it sliding along in its little own little world. I don't want to go in there. I was tiny, I could do that. 
Oh, wait, I can, can, can be tiny. It's right here. I enjoy the caution tape. Uh, just to peek around. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Pardon me, I've got to go. I'm sorry, I didn't realize Big Ben was part of this complex. Actually, they stopped Big Ben, didn't they? Did they ever turn it back on? Like for very, very, very long overdue repairs or something like that. That was my understanding. It hadn't been turned off for maintenance in like 120 years. Or something like that. Ooh, this could be interesting. Would you look at that? It's a Relith logo. Oh, ahem. I meant to push it the other way, but whatever. Just go up! Okay, then I go back up, and I cannot, except that there's a thing right here! Nice. Alright, you stay right there, me. Hopefully I'll be right back. Oh! It's just the easiest way to deal with those guys. Look, I'll even open the door for myself. Oh, I can just, uh... Yeah, okay. Oh, no! Okay, I can't get through there unless I'm doing that. Really be? Hell yes it can. Give me! Electrosis. Maximum energy level increased. Maybe it really is just, uh, a matter of finding the energy. What do I care? It does sound like he takes a big bite out of himself, doesn't it? I remember learning that a lot of the, uh, crisper noises from uh, Mortal Kombat are made by, like, just breaking vegetables. Like, there was a bit where, uh, in this video I saw where they... It showed a guy twisting a piece of celery until it broke in half in front of a microphone, and then it showed the same sound effect being played as someone's arm got broken. That turned dark. I've never been down here before. No, I haven't. Of course I have been here before. Look. What's all this stuff? Why was that a door closed then? Fuck it, I got a containment unit, and that's what matters. Let's get out of here. That sink was uh, a terrorist. Um, no green signs. Just keep going in any given direction until we find something. Uh huh. Up.
Can you imagine what it would feel like to see this horrific thing that has literally been tearing your co-workers apart and feasting on them? And you see it, and you just know you're going to die. And after having that experience, you have the experience of the creature rushing past you and totally ignoring you, and you don't know why. I believe it was Torek00 who once made that comment about, uh, the one person I spared in a room. They'll be spending the rest of their lives wondering, why was it me? I still don't know how to get over there. That's where I was trying to go when I went right from this screen, but, uh... Oh, hey. I'm not gonna lie, I was hoping there would be, like, a reverse final boss fight where I would get, like, a fourth stage that would just fill up half the screen and I'd have to fight a bunch of mechs and stuff. Now it is a toilet. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. Why is everything shaking? Oh, I've flooded this entire region. Down, down, down. Was this the... Oh, God, where was it? Where was it? Was I anywhere near here? No, I guess it wasn't. It was in a totally different region when I uh, found the container I couldn't get to. I guess that one must really be that you just need lots of uh, energy. You need more electrolysis or whatever the actual term was. Hi, me. Things are going pretty good. So was this thing's final, like, uh, ultimate objective just... Like, I made a joke about it earlier, but was it ob its objective to become human? Is that why it was eating so many people? To try and copy our DNA? I know that sounds silly, but I'm pretty sure they're legally required to do that, because staring into a laser can blind you in a relatively short amount of time. And if you hold a red laser up to a red halls and push the button, it, uh, glows in a really weird way. <gasps> the symbol! All right, my dude. You don't know it yet, but you're going to be very helpful to me. How do I get in there? No! This is the opposite of what I wanted. I'm definitely not going in there. I've broken that door, which means I've been in there, but... I didn't break any of the items in that room. Did I even start the timer? Yes. I don't know why they move sometimes, the, the, uh, the, the things on the wall. I wouldn't even call them nests. It's like, you know, it's like someone said early on, and I've been using that thing. It's just another piece of me. God damn it. Ah! Oh! need you to turn to the left. Thank you. You've been most helpful, Hugh. But not as helpful as this. Hmm. 
Can I? No, I cannot pull it back up and crush myself, as funny as that would be. Uh, in a totally deranged serial killer kind of way. Yeah, that covered all the bases, I think. Excuse me, pardon, you know what? Oh, I pulled a man with me, too. Alright, let's go over there. Let me take a look. Alright, what's the trick? I'm gonna pull this, and it can't open both of them. That would be too easy. Wait, how did I get in here? Oh, the door, yeah. Ha! I knew that. Where's that dead man? I need that dead man. Larry! Good news! You get to be Hugh again! Close enough. It's hidden behind the leaves because it's unspeakable. Like something they do in a movie from a few years back. Gory Discretion Shot, that's the name, that's the term. Wait, what? Well, I can't bring him in there, that'd be really, really convenient. Okay, I understand, I understand. Maybe this will be faster. I'll just run him over there. Oh, wait, 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 I fucked it up. story and just include a character named Hugh and just tell myself in my brain that that guy used to be the flesh. Now you're trapped in there forever. Not really because I know this one opened too, but... Ooh. Now he's back over there. Yes! Pyrophilia. Fire resistance increased. It takes longer to set the biomass on fire. Achieve an unlocked Jean-Michael Jar. I don't get that one. Okay, I uh, looked it up because I felt like that must be a reference to something. And uh, there's a French composer named Jean-Michel Jar. Except he spells it J-A-R-R-E, not J-A-R. <laughs> Silly. Save over the one where I was already a human. And away we go. That one TV is very resilient. There's no one in this jungle that wants to see those figures, but god damn it, it's going to keep displaying them. Because that's what it knows how to do, and that's what it's good at. Alright, where is another exit sign? Oh, hey, here we go. Yeah, I got it once I saw that one. You didn't need to put one next to the gaping door uh, orifice. What did I go that is it a human couldn't even walk through that? It's like teeth and goo on the inside? What's this say? Don't try harder, do harder. I don't like that one, to be honest. I don't feel like a uh, motivational message should put pressure on you. I 
guess I can just fuck off in this place, huh? Oh, and there's the timer. Ooh! Ooh! I was gonna just find a save point and get going, but... Let's head in here first, so we can pick up next time in Leviathan Reef. That was the sound of one of those guards in the suits dying. You know, I've given a few suggestions for what to do, what they think they could improve on if they do a carry-in too. Uh, I did have a couple of thoughts I wanted to say before I forgot them again. One of them was uh, that I think they. Uh, Well, I think they could use a little more enemy variety. I feel like it was just scientists, soldiers, uh, mechs, and two kinds of drones. I think that was it. Not including things like turrets and the grabby, explodey harpoon things. Oh, I've just noticed it put the uh, little extra bits on either side of my health bar. That must be the fire resistance. The other thought I had, and I thought this one is interesting. I don't know what you would do with it. But I think it would be neat if they did a carry-in too, and you were a different kind of monster. You know, like, do the space research station, and, uh, I don't know, you're fucking Tommy the Xenomorph. So I'm not sure how you, uh, how you would, you know, make it feel like carry-in if you were not this thing. Because it's a very specific individual, isn't it? In any event, I'm Burning Dog Face. And I will see you next time on Let's Play Carrion when we continue exploring for the last of those containment vaults. And, uh... Try and become the ultimate life form. Perfection awaits, Burning Dog fans. I'll see you then. Later!